Top of the morning to everybody. This is Brett from Video Hot Rod, and I have another filter for you. This one's called Vignette Mask, and this one's actually quite fun. Um, it's basically just a little simple rounded mask. It's designed for fun edges, backgrounds, things like that that you would put probably put somebody in the center and then on the edges put like a Christmas background or or love hearts or whatever you want to do. Today I've got rocks in the gutter and uh, cups. Those are the images I will be using. So as you can see it's already cut the edges out and basically what happens is this video right here is the part that's in the center and then it masks out so that you can put whatever else is in the back. Alright, so this is the standard default what it looks like reminds me of um, the old what is it price is right with Bob Barker it needs to have this little tiny fuzzy image of somebody down over here as they're going through the showcase saying oh I'll take this and I'll take that or whatever prizes they were doing I think that was price is right I don't remember exactly it's been a long time all right, so you have three different adjustments you, you can use. You can use the size, you can adjust the fall off, and you can adjust the center. Now, we discussed before this outer part is size. Well, actually, this outer part on this one is fall off. The inner part is size. And here's the center. You can pretty much grab these and drag them around. And you can animate any of these that you want. All right, so real quick, that was the vignette mask. Oh, look, it doesn't fit the same size. That's interesting. Hmm. Okay. That was the vignette mask in the Final Cut Pro X filters. And next we will go over one just called vignette, which is very similar, um, but not quite as drastic as this. All right, again, this is Brett from Video Hot Rod. Thank you very much for watching. <laughs>